Hi, Michael Blanc here with themichaelblanc.com. Thanks for stopping by. You're probably here because you're interested in learning more about investing in apartment buildings, and that is great. You're probably wondering how you do deals with little or no experience, with little or no of your own money, and we'll get to all that. First though, let's ask yourself why. Why do you want to go through all that trouble? Because it is, it's a lot of trouble. You know, why, why bother uh, on, on that journey? So ask yourself why. You know, for me, and maybe for yourself, you view apartment investing as a way to early retirement, maybe as a way to quit your job. Uh, but what does that really mean for, for you? You know, it could mean that you can quit your job, you can spend more time with your family, travel, do the things you really want, pursue a hobby, or maybe volunteer and give back. You know, what does that look like for you? And is it compelling enough for you to commit to and to go through a bunch of, you know, take a bunch of risk and maybe some worry and some challenges? What does that look like for you? Is it worth it? Can you see it? And if you answer yes to that, then we can talk about the how. You know, what gets me jazzed every day is doing deals and teaching others to do the same thing. It took me a little while to figure out that I was actually an entrepreneur. I was, uh, this was back in 2005, I was 35 at the time. And uh, you know, I actually have a software background and a master's in computer science, which is probably the best way to prepare for your real estate career. I'm just kidding, it's really not at all. The point is, I knew this about myself, but I really didn't take any action for several years until, until then. Um, now, I, uh, I had a little bit of a leg up to some people in the sense I made some money through an IPO through that software company, which I then parlayed into various different investments. So as I stepped out into a full-time investor, I had some money. However, I found out that there's really no trick to do stuff with your own money. And in fact, uh, my career has, didn't actually mature until I had no more money and uh, and had to do things with other people's money. And that's really where the, where the real trick is that I want to teach you and how, how to do. Anyway, so when I back in 2005, when I quit my job, I went into uh, two businesses. One is real estate and the other one a cash flow business, which is what I wanted. And I got into restaurants and uh, bought several and, and built several. But the restaurants are a challenging business. On the real estate front, I started flipping houses, you know, one or two at first, and then later on, uh, kind of built it up into more of a business where we did 30 in two years. And, uh, and when the market dried up, uh, I, m I moved on. I also recognized that I really wanted to do buy and hold. And again, building that passive income and long-term wealth, you can only do with uh, commercial, commercial property, in, in my opinion, and, and others as well. And so in 2011, uh, I purchased a 12-unit property with uh, with five other investors and that's really opened my my eyes to what is possible and I wish now that it had been a, a bigger building um, and a year later I syndicated the purchase of two restaurants as well so I've had a lot of experience now with different things you know I, I, I like different things and starting up different things and people have approached me repeatedly to share with them my experience take me out to lunch uh, I've taught classes before I had a a one-day training seminar on, on buying apartment buildings, which was very well received. And people really encouraged me to continue doing that. And finally, last year, I, I decided to pursue that calling and actually restart my blog and start writing and, uh, and, and teaching others. I realized that my purpose on earth is to continually make myself a better version of myself, but also to help others to do the same. And, and whenever I do those two things, I really feel most alive. And that's why it kind of what gets me excited every, every single day. I've experienced a lot of things with regards to entrepreneurship, uh, all the way from software to flipping houses, commercial uh, apartment buildings and syndicating deals. I feel like I can provide the most value by focusing on one aspect, which is uh, apartment building investing. I think it's the most reliable weld, way to build passive income and long-term wealth, and it's the most teachable of, of all the things, and something that I enjoy doing as well. So that's what we're gonna do uh, moving forward. So now we're back to the beginning of the video, which is asking yourself, you know, why do you wanna do that? If you can say why you wanna do it, and you can commit, to, commit yourself to learning about this, everything else is, in my opinion, very teachable. I can, I can teach you how to find the deals, how to do diligence, how to negotiate the contract, how to manage the building, sell the building, and how to raise the money from 
private individuals. Um, and again, if you're committed to it, then you can do the same thing that, that I've been doing and others have been doing also. So if you find all this interesting, I'd love to hear from you. Drop me a note on themichaelblank.com under contact or under one of my blog posts. You can also follow me on thebiggerbockets.com. I'm a weekly contributor to, to that as well. I did just put out my first product. It's called a syndicated deal analyzer, which will really, I think, uh, accelerate the way that you analyze deals. It certainly has for me. It's something that I've built now over the last six or seven years as I've analyzed deals. And it's unique in several respects. Number one is it incorporates other investors, different ways to structure the deal and how that impacts your financial projections. Uh, number two, it's fully customizable. It's not a black box or a piece of software. You can move things around, make it look the way you want it. You can look at the formulas in there and learn how the formulas work. Uh, but more importantly, it helps you answer the question, what is the most I can pay for this deal and why? Because when a deal comes in, chances are the numbers don't work. So it's not really a trick saying this is, a, this is not a deal. The trick is saying what, what number, what price is a deal and why so you can get back to the broker and seller with a rationale for your lower offer price. And it's a fantastic negotiating tool as well, as well as can be used to put together a deal package for your investors and lenders as well. So I'm excited about that. Check out the 15-minute uh, video under products so you can get a tour of the, of the spreadsheet of the analyzer. And I think you'll find it a, quite a, an indispensable tool in your investing career. So I think that's really it. We're, we're kind of wrapped up here. I hope you got to know me a little better. And I would look forward to hearing from you as well. Thanks.